Texting the wrong number can be a little creepy sometimes and kind of awkward in other moments, but a high school basketball player in Michigan really lucked out when it happened to him because by some strange twist of fate, he wound up on a FaceTime call with the Super Bowl champion Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Paul Gerke has video of the exchange. Paul, just show us what happened. This is so cool. This is the best case scenario for those of us with really clumsy thumbs. Not only getting to talk to a pro player, but getting treated to a truly special experience. So here's what happened. This group of high school basketball players tried to get a group chat together amongst teammates. But instead of looping in Luca, one mistyped digit brought a Super Bowl champion to the chat. 14-year-old Vinny Tartaglia thought making the freshman basketball team at Notre Dame Prep in Michigan would be the highlight of his day. I was really excited and just happy. But as the boys created a group chat with their new teammates, a strange reply came back. Did you mean to add me to this group? We were like, yeah, we, mean, we meant to add you if your name is Luca. And then he was like, no, 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 I'm not Luca. Another one of our teammates says, oh, you can leave because we didn't know who he was. The person on the other end turns out to be Sean Murphy you Bunting, a cornerback for That's the Tampa funny. Bay Buccaneers. And he sends a selfie to prove it. And everyone was just like doubting it because it was such a generic pose. Like he was just doing with the peace sign. So Bunting, who grew up not far from the boys in Michigan, FaceTimes the group chat. I was just going crazy because I was like, oh my God, like I'm on I'm on the phone with the Super Bowl champs. The kids start screen recording, so most of the clips are silent, but their shocked reactions come across loud and clear as the phone is passed around the locker room to some of the biggest names in football. Everyone's in complete shock, and he showed us players like Mike Evans, Richard Sherman, Gronk. Like Leonard Fournette, who takes them on a 10-minute tour of the locker room and facilities, apparently looking to see which other players might be around. And then an appearance from the GOAT himself, Tom Brady. I couldn't believe it. I was like, I was going crazy. I just was like in shock. I was, it was just super cool. You can see me. I was like, I pretty much dropped my phone and I was just like, like, like running around like, oh my God, it's Tom Brady. One boy runs to grab his Michigan jersey from Brady's college days, and Tom takes notice. He said something like, oh, is that my jersey? Brady was asked about the moment at his weekly press conference. I've been a highlight for me if I was in high school, too, and the pro home, the home pro team noticed me and uh, noticed our team. That would have been pretty cool. For the kids, it was a broken play that scored big. First, I would say thank you, obviously. I mean, didn't have to do that for us. And it was just like, it, it made us, it made all of our days. I just thought that was really nice of them to just show us around the locker room and show us everybody. I just thought that was really awesome. Adrian, it's one of those things that if we didn't have the video evidence, you would never believe those boys if they told you the story. Have you ever had an athlete make a positive impact on you like that? I had one hockey player return a card with an autograph on it once when I was a kid. Brendan Shanahan, a Hall of Famer. I wore the number 14 in every athletic competition since. I still wear it in spring and summer and fall softball here in New York City. Sport number 14, thanks to that one autograph. You know, it's nice to hear these stories. These kids are having these wonderful memories, like you did as a child. I had my great memories when I met athletes as an adult interviewing them. So between Kobe Bryant, Shaquille O'Neal, I've had some. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.